challenge welcome, worthy welcome. of my skills. I grow so bored with slaughtering these mindless training droids. I intensified my training tenfold in hopes I would get the chance to face you in Mortal Kombat. I am glad to see my training has not been in vain. Mortal Kombat, you say? <laughs> Hold on, wait. This guy wants to face us in Mortal Kombat. Don't let this castle touch me! God damn it. <laughs> Alright. You guys ready? We'll face him in Mortal Kombat. Choose your destiny. Yeah. Flawless victory. Choose your destiny. Let's do this. Flawless victory. All right. Let's try to stasis field you. I'm not sure if it's going to work. <laughs> and we'll just kind of go. Go all in. Ooh. Jolie's down already. Stop draining me, you asshole. Alright, let's level her up. To get that heal. Whoops. Oh, she has another one after this, too. All right. I need you to start doing something other than just normal attacking. Dude, he, he healed himself almost all the way up. All too easy. He said that he wanted to, uh, face me in Mortal Kombat, and I don't. Dark Jedi Master Rogue, finally! Yes! <laughs> Ooh, a new crystal, I haven't seen that one. Speed plus flurry is broken. I keep forgetting about speed, I keep forgetting to use it in combat. Alright, I am going to use the dark... Jedi Master Robe? If I can find it. Wait. Didn't it say Jedi Master? Am I... Did I read that wrong? Am I just... This castle don't kill us all? What? Uh... Oh, I didn't... I didn't get the items. I was like, wait a second! I know I saw it! Alright. Dark Jedi Master. There we go. If you're buffed properly, enemies won't even get a chance to move. I'm gonna have to try that. So, speed and flurry. And what do the Sith gauntlets do? This is plus two, the one that I have. This is, ooh, plus three, yes, thank you. I will take that. And I'll give her one of them too, since she's a guardian. What else did I yes. get from him? I got a belt. What belt did I give, or get? Mind affecting? My immunity to mind affecting. I'm gonna do that. Yes. Cool. I do have an energy shield. Oh wait, I used them all. My bad. I don't have any more physical shields, actually. That sucks. Alrighty. Let's push forward. Nice. There's a bench here, too. I was just thinking, like, how am I supposed to alter my lightsaber and use that new 
Holy shit, look at all these grenades. And use that new uh, crystal that we found. But in the very next room. <laughs> so many blasters. Powered battle armor, Sith energy shield, prototype shield. I wonder what the prototype shield does. Hopefully it's a physical one. Perception visor. Sonic nullifiers. Hmm. Let's see what that prototype shield does. Still not physical, but better than what I had on. Um, Sonic nullifiers, resistance. What really uses sonic damage, though? I don't think it's something that it, it's been a giant worry of mine this far, anyway. Alright. <clears throat> so now I can finally put some crystals into Juhani's lightsaber. Let's see what this Upari crystal does. Whoops. Three attack bonus and 1d8 energy bonus. That's pretty good. Not gonna lie. I'm gonna take Juhani's crystal, make it red. Give her some damage. 2d6, 1d6. Ooh, that one's pretty good. Massive criticals. Yeah, I'm gonna try that one on her. Sweet. Your wish. Okay, Juhani, try your new new lightsaber. <laughs> Every now and then, I just have to rave with a lightsaber. What is it? What? All right, <clears throat> we're our full health. Uh, where am I going now? I'm assuming here. It's the only place that I haven't been. Um, I guess I'll go out and can I leave through here? I can. Okay. So I'll go around here and see if I can get in through this side. Hopefully I don't have to go all the way around. Uh, it looks like there's a door. I see the faint green line. Ah, it's locked. God damn it. All right. Yes. Uh, give us the runs. Just got to go all the way on to the other side. Um, that one, okay. So it's the next door. Sure. I'm not sure if something happens when I go through here, so. Ah, okay. <laughs> so it's a different area. Hello, droid. Hello, two droids. Yeah. Deadly frag mine? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Nobody move. Where'd I go? Oh, it's over here. Okay. Okay, so I should be able to just click this. Data pad. Do you like KOTOR 1 or 2 better? Um. Okay, so I like the first one better, but I probably have a bias because I just have fond, nostalgic memories of the first one. Like, I, I got it when I was 16 years old. I, I think it was the first game I had to upgrade my computer to be able to play. And it was just, it was great. It was a fantastic gaming experience. And it's just, it, it'll always hold a fond place in my heart. But I do like the second one. I just, you know, I can't fairly compare them and give an answer that is not biased. 
Um, where's that data pad? Show new items. <clears throat> Where are you? Is this it? Mm, no, I don't think that's it. I think this is it. Novice Sith such as yourself cannot be trusted to remember even simple tasks. It is therefore prudent for your masters to explain themselves at length using very small <laughs> words. The ancient sequencer on lower levels can only be activated once all the sequencer tiles on the floor have been set to their active mode by walking on them in the correct pattern. To make all the tiles the same color, simply walk the tiles in the pattern of an H. I trust there will be not be another unfortunate incident like the last time. Okay. So walk on the tiles in an H pattern. Got it. Same here. Story is a special place for me. Second one was a lot of fun. Yeah, like I still like the second one. There's nothing wrong with it. <clears throat> I'll just always have a special place in my heart for this one. Hmm. Okay, so walk an H. Okay. But in which direction? Maybe it's this one? Yeah, okay, there we go. Why are they staying back there? Come on, guys. Get your booties over here. Welcome back, Revan. It's been some time since you last accessed my database. I was beginning to wonder if you had been terminated. I'm <laughs> hard to kill. An obvious conclusion given your presence here. However, my sensory input systems are detecting some significant changes in your composition since your last visit. Your neurological patterns exhibit subtle yet substantive alterations. Not substantial? in both thought patterns and information processing. These changes have been noted and recorded in my database. What are you? Completely self-sufficient, autonomous, interactive database constructed by the Rakata to record and store the entire history of the species. However, since the collapse of the Infinite Empire, there have been few events worth recording, and nobody has sought to access the information stored within my database until you came along. Due to my system's ability to monitor and repair themselves, you will find all the data within my archives has remained fully intact. Please choose the topic you wish information on. Starforge. Starforge was constructed during the apex of the Infinite Empire's power. A true technological marvel, it is an enormous space station that serves as both factory and battle dreadnought. The Starforge can mass-produce immense fleets with a minimum of time and resources. In addition, the Starforge also shares much of the same technology used in my own constructions. In many ways, the Starforge is like a living entity. It feeds, it hungers, it draws on the energy flowing through all living things, what you called the Force the last time you were here. This ability to feed and consume the living energy of the Force is the key to the Starforge's power, but ultimately it was also what led to this destruction of the Infinite Empire. I don't remember that part, actually. I don't remember the Starforge being basically Force-powered. <laughs> what do you mean? The Rakata are, by nature, a cruel and savage species. The Starforge fueled itself with the hatred inherent in its own creators, and in doing so, it accentuated these traits within the Builders. So it got corrupted by the Dark Side? In your terminology, the Starforge is a tool of the Dark Side. There we go. It corrupts those who use it so that it can generate greater and greater amounts of negative energy to fuel itself. The Builders thought they were strong enough to control this effect, but they were wrong. They became victims of their own creation, and eventually their hatred turned them against each other. Civil War destroyed the Infinite Empire. A lesson to remember. Only one who is immensely strong in mind and will can harness the power of the Starforge without suffering a similar fate. Due to my system's ability to monitor and repair themselves... Oh, we already saw that. How can I shut off the disruptor field? The, disru the disruptor field was constructed as the Starforge's primary defense against enemy attack and can only be deactivated from the upper levels of the temple. 
How do I get there? My systems control the doors from to the upper levels, allowing only those who are worthy of the Rakata legacy to pass. The last time you were here, Revan, I unsealed the doors for you. However, the subtle neurological changes I detected in you earlier likely caused a failure in recognition system that would have opened the doors for you. I have updated my database to recognize the new configurations in your mind, Revan. The doors to the upper levels will once again open for you. Okay. Alrighty. Perfect. That's that door that we tried to go in and it was sealed from inside. I wonder why they stay there. Yes. Use Jolie to force run again. Oh wait, yeah, this was a separate area. I was like, wait a second, why are we changing areas? And we have to cast this again. Wee. That's pretty. Man, those high quality skyboxes really make a difference. Okay. Here we go. Sure. I'm assuming this is the one that they were talking about. Um, okay. Just two of them. Just use Force Lightning and Destroy Droid, and then just kind of slap them to death. Yes. No. No. Never too old for this. Didn't mean to talk in the middle of the fight. Jeez. All right. I honestly do not remember what happens in here. Temple Summit. Are they gonna load me up full of med packs and stuff? Nothing? Mm. Stims and construction kits. Oh, look at this. Look at that. I'm... That's an interesting dance that I'm doing. Stop it. Open the damn thing. Are you kidding me? You're just spazzing out? <laughs> what a weirdo. Okay. Oh, okay. This is this area. I got it. I suddenly remember what happens here. for me. Malak thought you might be afraid to enter the temple again, but he doesn't know you like I do. Not anymore. Not since you've changed. Quickly. Bastila, come with us. We have to escape before Malak arrives. Escape? You don't understand. I have sworn allegiance to Lord Malak and the Sith. I am no longer a pawn of the Jedi Council. <laughs> Dude, you bitched at me the whole game whenever I did something wrong. You're a goddamn hypocrite. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking Surely about? you know what I mean, Revan. Look at what the Council did to you. They turned you into their puppet. The same thing they do to all who are truly strong in the Force. They speak of the dark side as if it is something to be feared. But in reality, their only goal is to manipulate those who are strong in the Force. The fear of the dark side is a tool to maintain control. Why do you think the Jedi forbid you and Malak from joining the Mandalorian Wars? They knew you would realize your true potential and break free of their domination. Malak has shown me how the Jedi Council have been using me the same way they once tried to use you. They've been holding me back because they knew one day I would surpass them all. Mm. I see your weakness let Malak convert you rather quickly. I resisted it first. I endured the Sith torments with the passionless serenity of a true Jedi, emptying my mind. But after a week of endless tortures, it's been a I week. saw the truth. Malak forced me to acknowledge my anger and pain. He showed me the liberating power of these emotions. 
Then he made me see how the Jedi Council has denied me what is mine by right. The what Jedi Council yours? gladly used my battle meditation in their wars, but they still treated me like a child, like an inferior. They were jealous of my power, of what I could become. They wanted me to bow and call them master and follow their code and obey their every order. But all the while, they were exploiting my battle meditation for their own use. I am Revan, Dark Lord. <laughs> Doesn't that seem like a non sequitur to anybody else? She's like, yes, this is how the Jedi use me. I hate the Jedi, blah, 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 blah. And I'm just sitting there going, uh. Like, it really reminds me of just like, I'm sitting here and zoning out while she's talking. And then I realize that she stopped talking and I'm freaking out like, oh shit, what did she just say? And I'm just like, uh, I am Revan. <laughs> you used to be Revan, master of the Sith, but no longer. You were simply a pawn of the Jedi Council in the Republic they serve. Like I was, until Malak freed me from their shackles. A pity the power you once had is so diluted in you. You could have been as strong as I am now. Stronger even, but that will never happen now. With the power of the Starforge, Malak will destroy the Republic and this conquer bitch. the galaxy. And I will be the apprentice at his side, after I prove my worth by killing you. Ghost Freak 91, thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. She drank that Kool-Aid so quickly, dude. Want to take bets how quick we destroy her hypocritical ass? Where are those big words now, bitch? You were stronger than I would have thought possible after what the Jedi Council did to you. <laughs> Seems that Malak was wrong. The power of the dark side is not lost to you after all, Revan. Now you see the power of the true dark lore. Yes, Revan. I was there when you almost died in the trap set by the Jedi Council. I used the Force to preserve your life. We are forever linked by my actions on that bridge. The Council tried to exploit our bond. They hoped your memories would lead me to the Star Forge, but in our shared visions of the star maps, I also tasted the power of the taint within you. You deserve you to be the true master of the Sith, not Malak. I see this now. Together we can destroy Gross. Rose Apprentice. Join with me and reclaim your lost identity. How can I reclaim my identity if I can't even remember it? Your mind was too badly damaged to ever fully restore your memories, Revan, but your power your strength of will, the essence of who and what you are, these things still remain. Once, long ago, you defied the Jedi Council, freeing yourself from their control. You claimed your rightful title of Dark Lord of the Sith. Together we can defeat Malak and take back what is yours. Yep. Hashtag taint power. <laughs> and together we can rule the galaxy. Listen to me. The dark side leads to death and destruction. I've seen the horrors the Sith have unleashed on the galaxy. Turn away from this path. Shut up, old man. Your time is over. The age of the Jedi and the Republic is no more. This is the age of Darth Revan and the Sith. Don't do Hell this, yeah. I don't want to, but I'll fight you if I have to. Even really? Even if it costs me my life. Oh, shit. I didn't realize, like, I, because I've never done the dark side run, I didn't know that this happens. Oh my god. I am the Lord of the Sith. And so it ends for you. I am the Lord a of the Sith. I would never bow down to the Sith. If this is your decision, I have no choice but to do battle against you. Kill her. I have to kill both flesh. of them? Show her the fate of all who dare stand against us. Embrace the power of the dark side. Be the first of many Jedi that fall before me. Oh no. Well, guys, this is the very, very first time in 13 years that I've spent playing this game off and on that I've ever done the dark side. And so I. Ah, oh, man. Let's do it. Yes. The sacrificial blood will consecrate this ancient temple in the name of the Sith. Goodbye, old man Hilbert. With the death of the Jedi, the rebirth of Darth Revan will be complete. 
Bastila helped me, right? Yeah. Man, I gave them all my good shit. <laughs> Should reload and make them completely naked. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. Wait. We have to. For science. We have to do this for science, guys. I'm sorry. Hold on. I'm making them all naked before I make this decision and seeing what happens when they decide to turn on me. Because they're still using the, the equipment that I gave them. So. <laughs> I'm curious. It's for science. We have to do this. It is very important. Revan, I knew you'd come for me. Quickly, escape. Wait, wait, what? Hold on. I must have... <laughs> must have did something wrong. What? Which one did I pick wrong? I thought I chose the ones that I did last time. Where did I go wrong, guys? Okay. Yeah, we gotta... <laughs> Looks so funny to watch them walk up in their underwear. Revan, quickly. Bastila, calm with oh, you have to fight her first. Oh, you're right. Oh my god. I'm so stupid. Show this white malak. You are absolutely correct. I map the jet they want you puppet with the power of the star. I'm just dumb. What? Yeah. Oh shit. actually putting up a fight when my people are naked. <laughs> Jakey D13, thank you for the follow, man. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for hanging You're out. Stronger than I would have thought possible after what the mm, Yes, that Revan, one. the count you dis You're that one. one. That Listen, one. Don't do that but one. Kill. Okay. Yes. Oh my god, it worked! That's so cheap! For the order! They're just trying to punch me to death. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> That's so fucked up. Oh my god. That's even worse than killing them, just normally. There is a computer here on the temple summit that has access to the power generators. You can also use it to disable the disruptor field that protects the Star Forge. Otherwise, the Ebon Hawk will not be able to leave the planet without crashing. Rip, you guys. I just realized it's brand support. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I was expecting that. <laughs> Ooh, look. Hidden things. Base level med packs. Ooh. Oh my god, Bastila. Get the fuck out of my way. What can I do? You can get the fuck out of my way. Sure. Okay. Let's see what this does. Disable that. Shut down the energy field. Whatever. Alright. 
Time to escape. This craft is too small for you and Bastila together. You have to use the Ebon Hawk. Then why is it? Oh. Uh, is that if you just kill everybody? Can you do that? 